In this short video, I will show you how to place and orientate a coordinate frame that aligns with specific geometry features and not necessarily with the global axis system like in this particular model. Over here we see a cylindrical coordinate system that aligns with the hull. And over here we see two Cartesian systems, one of which where the y-axis aligns with this edge and another where the y-axis aligns with that edge. But you can also align any of the other axes with any feature of your choosing. Let me show you how. So we start off entering the coordinate tool. And at this stage, you only have one application method available to choose from, the angle Euler method. But you don't need to specify the Euler angles in this input box. Further, you have the option of your normal rectangular, cylindrical or spherical coordinate systems. So let's start with the normal rectangular coordinate system and assume we would like to place a coordinate system on this face and have its x-axis align with an edge over there. We can see that if we hover over the edge, the x-axis is by default aligned with the edge that, that we choose, but, this, but let's say I want to place it somewhere else on this face and have that x-axis still aligned with that edge over there. We can see that the z-axis is by default perpendicular to the face, but not any of the other axes to any of the other features. So to manipulate how we actually do this, we pick the, the location. Now this location could be any feature. It could be a vertex, it could be a node, or any pre-existing uh, element or even any of these magic points of the uh, of cylinders uh, features etc assume we have a location over here that we want to place this coordinate system at but now i want its x-axis to be aligned with that edge over there this is done by a simple trick which is not that easy to spot you double click on the ball and then you select the axis that you would like to align with something else. In this case, the X axis and you see that it turns purple. And now we have an option to pre-select or finally select any feature we like and have it aligned with that feature. So now we see the X axis is aligned with our edge over there. If you wanted to point the other way, you could have done the following. Select the location, double click, select, select the feature, but you can see it doesn't matter where I select it, it always points in one direction, but I can now simply select that edge, press R on the keyboard, and now I come up with the options to reorientate using entered values over there. And that is how you locate and orientate any coordinate system using geometry as a reference.